global warming is coming faster than we think. Or maybe it isn't. Who knows? Is it real? Yo guys, what's happening? Dave Waffle here and you've bounced your way here into I.O. So do you guys believe in global warming or do you think it is fake? Let me know. Mm-mm, down there. So we're talking about temperatures. They go high, they go low, they go pretty much all over the place. So guys, it's official that in Antarctica this year, they have hit record high temperatures. That's right, they hit a temperature of 63.5 degrees, making it actually warmer than it is in New York City. Man, we put our buildings in the wrong places. Let's move New York City down to Antarctica. Now this temperature was recorded by the Esperanza base, which is in the northern part of the Antarctic Peninsula. Now, now according to reports, they say that temperatures have gone up on an average about 5 degrees over the past 50 years. But let's not jump to conclusions guys, because it has been this warm, well, almost this warm before. Back in 1961 on April 24th, they had a whopping 62.8 degrees Fahrenheit. Now Jordan Greth, he is a researcher at the Cooperative Institute for Meteorological Satellite Studies. And he pretty much goes on to say that it's hard for us to tell whether or not global warming is happening, yes or no. Cause this is kind of just one of those one off, one day, it was really, really hot. However, he does say that if temperatures do rise over the next 10 years, well, it gives him a much better sight of the big picture. However, over the last 18 years, 18% 18 of the ice shelves have actually shrunk. And this is all because warm water is floating underneath the ice. Anyway guys, I want to know what do you do for your part to contribute to a much cleaner environment? Thanks for watching guys, I'm Dave Wobble, keep it real, keep it class, keep it on the flip side, out there in the green world. Or should I say ice world? Well, I guess really not the ice world because it's all melting away. <laughs> then it'll become water world like Kevin Costner, which was a totally amazing movie and it's so awesome and so much fun, it just was a giant flop and cost a lot of money to produce.